Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Now today I'm just doing like a Minecraft challenge. So over the next half an hour um the world border is going to shrink to 500 blocks. And I also just chose a random position uh, for the world spawn to be. And, yeah. So, and then I killed myself. And I've ended up here. Really not the best place to be when the board is shrinking. Uh, so, it's pretty... Luckily, I can't see the border from here. But, I, for some reason, whenever I press F3, um, like, uh, my laptop thinks I'm trying to turn the volume down, and it, it there isn't an option to change it, so I have to press, uh, I have to change toggle, uh, perspective to right control. This is actually wasting time. I need to start swimming quick. And I don't want to go, like, although I don't know where I am, I'm pretty sure I might. Is there anything which tells me? Does, does Optifine, like, tell you on the screen? I'm not sure. Because I do have Optifine, I just don't usually um, get it because the normal version of 1.16.5 is what pops up first. Yep, I knew it. I'd waste hunger trying to kill the pig so I could get hunger. I'm gonna go this way. Because I see a shipwreck, which is wood. And I also see like a raise in the ocean. So that could either mean that an island's coming up or it's just a random bit where the ocean has raised. Well, once I attempted to do a speed run, and I got really lucky, but then I died to a zombie. That's also why I need to use Optifine. My game lags far too much. Okay, there's nothing valuable in the chest. There must be another chest. That can't be it. Come on. We look. I know it did have a buried treasure map, which we. I could actually take the treasure map, not because there. That's what I want. Oh. oh. I need to go down and get the treasure map because a uh, buried, buried treasure map is usually buried on land. You know, while I'm doing this, the whole time the border is shrinking quite fast as well. It's going to shrink 2,000 blocks in 30 minutes.
So, we need to find some kind of land. Because if we don't, that could be quite a big problem considering that well, we currently, uh, the border's currently closing again. I don't know where I am. And... I guess it just makes the challenge more challenging and uh, not being able to use F3. My original spawn was so much better. So, for all I know, I could be right next to the border right now. Yeah, I can show you that my latest command is to do that. Because at first I moved the border in as well because um, cause obviously the border in normal Minecraft is very far out. So I just wanted to move it into 2,500 blocks. I'm doing this so I can get saplings. Because... Um, once the border does close in, a lot of the islands might, and it only closes into 500 blocks, and if it's not even affected me, I'll probably close it into like 200 blocks. And the challenge is just to survive as long as I can, and if I don't die by the 30 minute mark, uh, yeah, it definitely should be going in. I'm just going to see, is it like, I came on the island, so where I came I could see sugarcane, yep, so. I was just seeing uh, which way the border was because. I want to see like how close I actually am to zero zero. Because that's where I really want to be, because that's where I can survive the longest. Uh, do you guys like these types of videos where um, I do Java edition and like if you like these challenge videos I can continue doing them but like with maybe different data packs or mods just to make the game a bit more interesting like let's say but they're oh, okay this sun is stuff yep 10 minutes in and I haven't been affected by the world border yet, but I haven't made much progress yet. And I really want to be making progress because, you know, once the border does come, I want to have all the essentials. instead of stitching there with my wooden axe.
For some reason, my mouse really doesn't like me today. So whenever I try and do something, it's like, no, you can't do that. And it keeps... The, for some reason, the sensitivity is really high. This has never happened before. Maybe it has, I just didn't notice because I was playing feet for a bit. You know? What, what type of video uh, do the people who watch these videos like FIFA or this? Because like, I don't really. I, sometimes I see some videos getting like that Universe Sandbox one I got um like 54 views on. That's one of my most viewed videos, and that was just like quite quick, and I didn't like have it on repeat or something. So. No. I'll just surrender. Ju don't attack me. I'm going to the closest civilization I can see. Oh god, that's a sea temple. This would be quite a nice seed if I if I'm narrator. Ah I hate Correcting. Ah I hate you narrator. How do you turn it off? How do you even turn it on? Chat setting, music and sound options, options, uh, video options. Um, I see. Chat settings. I hate you. Narr narrator off. Oh, I turned you off. Why do you have to speak to me after I turn you off? I don't know why I'm getting mad at a game for telling me that it was turned off. We have literally like 17 more minutes. It's not very long and I've got nothing. Yeah. I found it. Yeah, when it's red, it, it means it's moving in. So, like, if I stand here, you should actually be able to see it moving in. Oh, God, no. And, yeah, like, so. I must be, I don't know, 2,500 blocks out. I'll probably be right now. I just want to go this way. I don't think the really. Okay. Just want to make sure that I've got a safe distance away from it. I think I have. That was close. Because when you do actually encounter the border and it passes you, uh, you die, you suffocate. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely quite safe right now. What I should be more worried about is it coming in that way. Why 
Why does it keep doing this to me? There. Now I can just hold W and control. I haven't seen land in days. Five more minutes of the night. A day in Minecraft does actually last 20 minutes. It's not just some people say because this is actually true. Like, I was like, is it really or does it last a bit shorter? It does. Because I'm 15 minutes in and it's midnight. So that would mean that uh, the day and the night would both be 10 minutes. When will I see land? I think I just chose the worst seed I could have for this. This really isn't a very good seed. Especially for a challenge where the border is going to come in. I might actually have to just time lapse this bit of me swimming because a time lapse of, for five minutes would be a bit too short but yeah if, is, is, if this is what I'm going to spend my mornings doing you know right now I could be in the nice sun playing football or I could be Baking. There's so much that I could be doing right now, and I chose to do this Minecraft video, which which is gonna be really. I'm I'm gonna have to just uh like just quickly get onto that island. It, I think it's so small that you know I'm I'm so happy because it's Latin. Like inside, I was really happy. So I've finally found what I've been searching for, some land, and it turns out to be that. Yes, and a shipwreck. I will do speed runs soon. Because this reminds me of that one speedrun I once did and I got iron pretty quick. Oh no. Ah, uh, Babby Zombie. Babby Zombie, no. Uh, they're in my nightmares. just need to wait for the sun to come up i'm gonna watch the sun rise or maybe i'll die i think i will die Nope, I'm leaving it. This is too dangerous for a handsome man to be. I'm not sure if this skin is too handsome, but... And it doesn't really look like me, it was just I thought, considering that I usually wear a king skin, as soon as I'll wear this literally until the 1.17 update actually comes out. this monstrosity <laughs> it's not really bad it's quite good skin like I didn't make it but the person who did well done you're clever like I remember watching the minecraft stream for the new update and I was like oh my god some of these features <gasps> My spawn has been engulfed by 
the boulder. And that's where it just spawned me here. In the middle of the ocean, of course. Well, I can see land for once, but... Haven't I came here before? Well, yeah, I'm pretty sure I swam over this. Like a bit. Wait, wait, get me above this. So although it pushes me down, it'll give me extra bubbles. Don't know how that works, but okay. That was a dumb move. I didn't notice it had curse of binding. I thought it had curse of vanishing, which wouldn't be too bad, but still kind of bad. Uh, at least I have a flint and steel, so if I do see any monsters, I can burn them to a crisp. And then eat the nice, tasty crisps. Oh, that's a nice little coincidence. I spawned next to where I died. I'm going to go over to this one. It looks like there's more trees. This challenge really hasn't gone super successful. But I, I've only encountered the border once. And I didn't go past it. I have a feeling that this little cute island here will get completely swallowed by it. If it does go that far. Where is it? I think it's in video settings. Yeah, the reason I don't keep on 32 chunks is it's not super laggy on this world. Uh, or oh, it is loading far too many chunks at once, but wait, um, no. But it's not too laggy on this world because it's just, uh, because it's just water and islands. But on others, I like to keep it at 8 just because it can get to you laggy. Especially on my survival world where I had quite a few chunks loaded. Because on my survival world that I used to do, I, I don't do it. Well, I will do it. Well, it's not my YouTube survival world, but um, I did do it. And I, I did really good progress on it, but as soon as the snapshots came out, I upgraded it. But um, now the newest snapshots are out, but I can't upgrade it yet. So I'm waiting for Mojang to figure out a way to upgrade uh, 1.16 worlds to 1.17. You can't you see why it's a bit laggy? My blocks, my, my blocks aren't breaking quick enough but it does actually give me a really good view and I will be able to see where the border is oh actually even while I'm recording it's not too bad other than when it's loading the chunks which can be really laggy it's not too bad because on any like thing loading chunks and with a screen recorder can be laggy I just want to see how far is the border now. Okay, so it is coming for me. like that weird thing that looks like a finger pattern is that it 
because there definitely is something there which is red kind of it's very far in the distance but okay is that the border just here yeah i think that definitely is so now it's at a point where i can see all edges of the borders very faintly but yeah i think that's it because it's very far out so yeah you know i might actually be quite close to zero zero because uh, i'm not having many problems uh i'm having problems with lag so i'll probably have to turn my uh wait um aren't they planning to oh no i'm not having uh fabulous i'm just gonna have fast oh i want to have fast on everything and i think clouds are so fast and i'll just turn clouds off yeah it already feels better those changes it's still not great but it's playable at this point So we have like five more minutes. I know uh, for you it's like not five more minutes, but uh, we I have like five more minutes because uh, I think I paused the game a couple times. Yeah, you can just see it slowly. Yeah. That looks cool. Like, I know it's actually re really far away. Oh, I take that back. I need to get my resources and leave. What looks like zero, zero? Nowhere is safe. Nowhere. I think zero zero is the middle of an ocean. What do I do? What do I do? I need to search for apples. But this isn't quick enough. I think now I can actually see it from all edges instead of it being very faint on all edges. Wait, imagine if it stops, like, here, and I'm standing here, and I'm like, what? <laughs> that probably won't happen, but imagine if it did, that would be kind of funny. Like, I survived it by, like, I could be like, I survived it by two blocks, or like, one half a block. <laughs> no one would believe me. You know, I have literally made no progress. You know, at all. Like, at all, at all. I've literally got some sugar cane. Oh, yeah, that, that's just showing you how fast it actually is moving in. The border has now... Wait, I just want to see... I'm sure that it damaged you when it went when you went past. That's just a test, okay? Now I now I need to only turn it down to like um a couple chunks. Well, a lot less than I have it on because I'll I'll, I'll halve the distance that I can see because I don't need to see um, past the borders. It stopped. 
it stopped. Although the island that I was using was um, fully taken over. Wow, wow, that is... I was lucky I was able to find this place or I would have been a goner quick. Because I didn't notice that I was so close to zero zero. You know what? Just to make it a bit more challenging. One. In the next. 360. So it will be going in really quick. Well it should be. It's gonna go in like 500 blocks in four minutes. I think I set it for six. I'm not sure. One of the two. So I'm, I'm gonna try and find the center quick. So I know I'm quite close to that one, but my plan is I'm just gonna follow it go in. So then I can actually be at zero zero. Oh, that's it gets in so wait again i'm just gonna give you an idea of how quickly the border is actually moving like it's from this distance it does actually look like it's moving quite slow but no it is not moving quite slow right right if I just stood here AFK for like a minute, that I would be like a hundred blocks away from this. So yeah, I gotta run. I can't just stand next to it. Okay. Here, I I want to be able to see all the borders from one place so I can kind of get a guess of where zero zero is so I can see that one I can see that one I can see that one the best and I can see that one the worst so I think now I think zero zero is here and I can see this one worse okay there now it will slowly close in until it actually gets to zero zero. Ah, I think they're escaping to zero zero as well. But I don't want them to, I want to kill them, I want to get the, the niceness of being able to kill things that want to kill me oh god this is really close <laughs> you know i just thought it would be a bit more challenging if i made the border come in even more how much does damage two maybe that's why it's taking forever to kill them i'd rather do this with my fist but it still does do more damage so No, my space bar is literally just going to break if I continue. <laughs> and then I won't be able to record videos. Get back, you monster. Get back, you monster. You know... Oh. Uh, it'll take like two more hits for these. They're just not gonna die, are they? Oh, it's got a lot further in than I know. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna make a guess that zero zero is here. That's exactly where I want to be. So, like a drowned army or something that's after me. Okay. I think I killed three. 
We can eat their flesh. More flesh. Tasty. You know, I don't think rotten flesh is really that tasty, especially with those green bits on it. Oh, it's still moving in. I don't require to have it on such high chunks anymore. I think six should be fine now. Oh, it is so close. I've died twice, but I haven't died to the border yet. And that's my goal, not to die to the border. You know, I'm, I'm not even trying to kill them at this point. I'm just trying to punch them away. Maybe I can punch them out of the border. That would be funny. How many drowns is there? There must be some kind of drowned spawner down there. Maybe a zombie spawner that just got filled with water or something. Because this does not seem possible. What are these drowns? doing okay they're actually starting to damage me it's done it's done the border is literally one that looks so strange ah uh, i'm gonna die i'm literally gonna die as i got in the right place for the yay well, bye guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video, this was a very interesting video, I just thought of a cool idea that I might could, I might could do, I could do, well I might do, <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, I just thought of a random idea and that was it, uh, trying to survive a border coming in, originally I didn't do one because that would be a bit hard having to find exactly zero zero but I hope you like the video I enjoyed making I hope you enjoyed watching it and bye